the mentorship program a very rewarding experience. Uh, I got a lot out of it. Uh, I, I actually have developed quite a lot. And I think my work's, work's improved quite a lot uh, because of it. I found that uh, conceptually, I worked a little bit more conceptually on my ideas, refined my ideas. Nihan helped me on a lot of levels. She helped me obviously on my conceptual um, levels and she helped me with skills. So she, she, she showed me certain things that I should do better in my work, certain things I should focus on. And I actually really took in her advice. And I think it's something that I'll, I'll carry over to my next exhibition and for the rest of my career. I feel that uh, the amazing thing about Diane um, was that she she didn't encourage me to change anything uh, stylistically, but um, she helped me develop in the kind of style that I have. She helped me um, work on the techniques and my um, ideas. This exhibition is about history and how history is used by the current status quo to form a certain kind of political conception. History is told in simple narratives, too simple, and there's a lot of nuances and a lot of fine intricate details to, to, um, to history. And they're usually left out in the narratives that governments give us. And those narratives give governments power. So I attempt to challenge those narratives, not necessarily with our current government, but in governments in general. So I'm trying to challenge uh, power. I do quite a lot of research and I travel quite a bit to um, get my material. For this exhibition, I try to use well-known images in my work. And I try and get all the images and then draw them with a the paintbrush pen um, onto drafting film. And that's where everything starts. And then, then I turn it into big paintings like this. I paint by hand. Each and every single image on its own represents an idea. I've built up an entire library of ideas and putting the images together in a certain way creates a, a language of its own. I pattern the same images over and over again. Most of my patterns come from India, from my travels there, and um, Russia. And a pattern is a way of encapsulating an entire civilization. So it's a way of taking that, that whole civilization, putting it right into your work.